Hello there. In this tutorial, I am going to show how to prepare population density map in QGIS. Here WB shapefile will need population data. So I have downloaded population data from census of India. This data from 2011 census data. And here our data, Jharagra male, female, district wise data. And my shapefile also district wise. So first of all, I have to join it in shape file. So for this purpose, we have to save it in CSV file. See, this is in CSV file. This one in CSV file format. Okay. You can easily save it in CSV format, like go to file, save as, and save it like this way in CSV comma delimited. Okay, so already I have saved it, no issue. I can add it in QGIS interface. Now here we can add it our data like delimited text. We have to select this delimited text. Now we can add it by browsing this here. We have to browse it like I have saved it here. District WB data, this one and open it, right? This is a no geometry data so we have to select it no geometry only we need attribute data now here we can change it we can add male we can add female or we can add all so just add it and close this now go to this w shape utm go to this open activity table see this layer name gm layer name name in here district name name zero mean country name and name one mean state name so i want to add it according to this district name here also we have one district name column so we have to check it here open activity table name so name here district name so now go to wp shape and go to properties we can easily join by clicking this here this one join and here the plus symbol that's when add new join we can add it district wb now join field so i want to join it according to this name okay now targeted field it should be same as name so we have to change it from here name now join label select it now we can add all or we can select only male and female click it okay apply and okay now go to again here open activity table now see data population data wb district male and female now i want to prepare density map that's why i have to add new field so i'm going to calculate new field here open field now we can create new field like total population i have male population and female population so i can use this expression we have to check it which field is there district wb data mail like this we have to check it okay now go to here district create field total if you type here district wb see this one district wb mail just double click here plus again type here district di distribute wb female okay so now just run this expression just select it okay so now this is a total population that's mean summation of male and summation of female mean total population so we have to also calculate area we can easily calculate area so just select again open attribute table now create new field area now select here geometry okay double click it now select this area this dollar symbol area okay there is a two form one area and another dollar symbol and area so area divided by because area in square meter we have to convert into square kimi we have to divide it by 1 million 1 2 3 4 5 6 now it will be converted into square kimi now area so we all know the formula of population density so population density mean pd 
formula of population density total population so total total population and divided by area so we have to type here area total population divided by area mean population density in square kilometer just click it okay now see here one population density now we can easily prepare our map right click here go to properties again now here symbology here single symbol we can change it to graduated color graduated color population density we have shown by coroplay so by graduated color okay now we can choose here color right it's okay for me now we have to classify it you can classify in many class five class three class according to your choice from here you can choose technique there is a many technique like natural break method you can select equal method okay i'll select natural break method and five classes we have to select first here value which value we want to prepare pd mean population density then we have to select here classify okay there is a five class right apply and okay now see our population density map is ready here white color mean very less that's been 115 to 544 and this color shows 4047 to 43357 now we have to export this map right so go to project and here new print layout population density map that's been code plate map okay we can add by drop down here already i have prepared one tutorial on that we can add it here like this this call add map we can drop down from here just select add map and just drop here okay this is population density map we can change scale from here okay for details check my previous video qgs layout we can also change everything this layout see here grids grids option if you want to add it grid just select this plus sign again select grid and modify this grid according to your needs here the interval x and y i don't know about the interval so just select one is it okay for you no it's not okay I, you can increase this so two two okay two is okay no so 5 degree into 5 degree right 5 degrees okay okay 5 degree in 5 degree so like this way here the grid type you can change to grid type like marker cross frame annotation only you can select frame annotation and here the frame you can choose from here frame and frame interior or exterior or line border interior trick okay i want interior trick like this you can add here coordinate like this you have to select this coordinate you can change it is format decimal decimal to minute second like this okay you can change this orientation vertical like this one left and right horizontal so this is left so here horizontal i want vertical ascending like this way here also in case of right i want vertical ascending like this way and if we want to change it this interval here interval in case of y5 so if you change it to then it will add 3 okay like this way we can add here other thing like scale you can add here scale you can change scale from here you can add one boundaries also if you select here you can add here one boundaries like it's called frame okay you can change this thickness of this frame like this way then we can add here title just type here title title here population density of west bengal right we can change font from here like here size 10 we can increase from here okay according to our needs or according to our choice so we can replace it 
we can place it anywhere like I want to place it anywhere other attribute you can add also not line like this way you can add not line you can change this not line type okay you can resize it like this way if you want to change this orientation then you can change also orientation this on landscape you can change it to put it okay then you have to change it like this way you have to change it this way so we can change everything from here select this frame and drop this you can select it and we can zoom it like zoom full okay now just increase this frame we can increase this frame like this way we can increase this map like we have to change the scale here the scale so we have to change the scale 43 so 20 let's check it move item content we can move item like this way okay so we can increase little bit like if we decrease scale like 18 yeah now it is okay so again this call select a move item we can select it and move it anyhow like I want to place it here and title here okay you can choose it very carefully okay now X we have to change it X like we have to do it again in grid this grid option here select grid select it modify grid we have to modify this X so 2 2 is ok yeah 2 is ok now it is here so this way we can prepare our map now we have to add legend right so we can add legend from here this is called add region just click it and drop it here to district wb shape we can change also name this name we can change from here so our final tax layout if we select here then export our map export as we can export in png format so i want to export it here in pd 300 dpi you can change also 300 to 600 okay now see this is our map population density map thank you for watching this